New census data out today reveals some major shifts in the Canadian population. A snapshot of a country growing more and more diverse. 21.9% of the population, 7.5 million people, were born elsewhere, the highest rate since 1931. And 1 1.67 million people identify as Indigenous. That's nearly 5% of the population and growing at a rate four times faster than the rest of the country. We'll have more on that in a moment. But first, CTV's Kevin Gallagher looks at what's behind the numbers. The face of our nation is now more diverse than ever, a mosaic of people claiming more than 250 ethnic origins. Gagandeep Guram came from India seven years ago and now helps others adjust to life in Canada. People are very welcoming, very warm. They uh, don't judge you, they accept you. More than one in five Canadians were born in another country, the highest percentage in 85 years. They're fueling population growth and at the same time meeting the demand uh, for very skilled workers. Most of the recent newcomers are from Asia, with the Philippines, India and China topping the list. By continent, Africa now ranks second, surpassing Europe, which 45 years ago made up more than 60% of new arrivals. For decades, most immigrants put down roots in Canada's three biggest cities. But in the past 15 years, the number of people settling in Atlantic Canada and the prairies has more than doubled. Eventually, the economic factors um, um, overweigh the, the social factors and, and people go to those places where there are more jobs. 7.7 .7 million Canadians now identify as a visible minority, seven times more than in 1981 when Statistics Canada started keeping track. And in Canada's largest city, those visible minorities are now a majority. Next week, the government will reveal Canada's immigration target, a goal experts say is vital for the country's economy, Sandy. All right, Kevin, thank you.